Hey guys, my name is Josh and I'm uh, posting this video right here because look, I wanted to give you guys an opportunity to understand that an orthogram is not a big deal. Okay, so when my experience happened, I I first went to Google and I said, okay, what is an orthogram? How, what, what's all involved? Because when I first heard, the doctor was like, yeah, it's not quite comfortable. They're gonna stick a needle in you and pump you with a, a liquid dye in, in your shoulder and it's not the most comfortable experience, but uh, you'll be all right. Okay, so I went in, I Googled it, and I found somebody's uh, kind of testimonial about their experience with an orthogram. And their experience was a lot worse uh, than mine. In fact, mine was really a non-event. Mine was actually kind of pleasant. Um, and so if you find that search that's out there that talks about you probably should have a sedative beforehand or you, you should maybe think about getting a ride there before and a ride uh, thereafter for you. My experience did not line up with that at all, guys. Um, so I'll kind of just tell you a little bit about the procedure and, and what it was for. So a couple weeks ago, I dislocated my shoulder. A doctor said, hey, let's go ahead and do a uh, MRI with contrast with the dye in your shoulder so we could kind of evaluate whether or not you're gonna need um, a surgery. And at that point, um, we could kind of give you a percentage ballpark figure of, hey, based on what we see, we think you have a 50% chance of your shoulder dislocating again, or you know, maybe it's just rehab and maybe you're better off not having the surgery. So that was the reason for the orthogram and the MRI today. And so I show up at the facility, I check in and do all the paperwork and all that kind of stuff. And then the tech comes in and gets me and they, um, they have me get in a gown. Um, and then they, they walk me to this x-ray room and I lie on the table and the tech is, you know, briefing me on what's about to happen. Um, basically telling me, hey, the doctor's going to come on in or the radiologist is going to come on in and he's going to um, wash up your shoulder a little bit, put some lidocaine on it. And then you'll feel a little bit of a, a, a a needle press going in you um, and that's when we're gonna be shooting the dye uh, in you so uh, anyway did a really good job kind of outlining what the procedure was gonna be like um, and then and then you know we go from there so the doctor came on and the radiologist came on in and exactly what she told me was gonna happen happened. he came in told me what was about to happen and uh, very professional very good um, and I told him, look, yeah, I have no problem with it. I'm gonna look this way. I, I prefer not to look at needles. Um, he told me um, kind of step by step what he was doing. And guys, it was a complete non-event. I did not even know he was done when he was done. Like he said, okay, we're all done. And that, I mean, to me, it was a shock. It was a non-event. I felt a little pinch when the needle went in, um, but had no idea the needle was going in um, into the joint had I mean I could not feel it was not painful at all um, so before I knew it he was done and it was over with and he said all right all done you're good to go so at that point I was good to go I waited about 30 minutes for the dye to kind of be in there um, and then I sat in the MRI or laid down in the MRI um, contraption and um, to me guys that it's honestly um, it's pleasant for me. I like it. I, uh, I, I felt it was really relaxing. Um, honestly, I, if you've never been in one of those MRI tubes before, um, if you allow your mind to drift, um, I could see how people could become claustrophobic, but if you close your eyes and just kind of relax and, um, kind of take it all in, it's actually not bad at all. So, um, I would encourage you, um, to just type in orthogram and, and take a look at this. Hopefully this, um, if you had a dislocated shoulder and the doctor is wanting to do what's called an orthogram prior to the MRI, that's basically just allows for the MRI to, to go with contrast. It's a dye in your shoulder, allowing the doctor to get a better visual of what's happening in the shoulder. So um, anyway, just got out of it like five minutes ago. So um, for me, my experience was completely pleasant. Um, really a non-event, so hopefully um, you guys have the same thing for you guys. All right, thanks for watching. We'll talk to you later. Bye.